very good morning to you all. Very nice to see you here. Um, and welcome to the joint NAVA and RICS Property Forum, Property Auctioneers Forum. Um, the NAVA and RICS Property Forum here in Warwick, it's the most important conference of the year. It's where we have the auctioneers have the opportunity of coming together. We enjoy meeting, we enjoy catching up with other auctioneers and talking about real practical issues which are important to us in the market. But I think one of the, the key things is the quality and seniority of the attendees. This is not sending um, recently qualified people to get CPD training, although that is very important. It's actually people who are at the front line, the practitioners, who are wanting to get together and really learn about best practice and to swap what other ideas of what other people are doing. So it has a really important function. Well, in the morning session, we've had three excellent speakers. We've had Charles Smales, who's a practicing auctioneer. He's also the former chairman of NAVA. We've also had Marvin Smith from Payne Smith, who's undoubtedly the preeminent landlord and tenant lawyer in the UK. And we've had Ray Bolger from John Charcoal. Ray's often seen in the media, and it's really interesting to listen to him about what he thinks is happening in the mortgage market now and what is going to happen in the future. This year's conference is extremely well supported, much to do with an excellent lineup of speakers. Uh, we've actually got more people attending this year's sale, which I think is fantastic in what is certainly a very difficult economy. And for people to take a day out really does mean a lot. There's lo lots of expertise at conferences like this because it's only the people that are really interested that tend to come along. So there's a good opportunity for interaction between the delegates as well as the, the speakers, um, which can clearly help everybody significantly in terms of um, in increasing you know, th their knowledge. So the opportunity for networking and um, increasing one's knowledge um, in, in that way I think is, is a key aspect of these sort of conferences. An absolutely critical part of any trade body which is often unrecognised, is what's done behind the scenes. And the more successful the trade body is in doing that, the less the members perhaps become aware of it because they don't see all the bad things that would have happened had that negotiation not taken place. Part and parcel of what NAVA have done, along with the RICS, only some nine years ago was to actually agree common auction conditions which have been accepted by the industry. We're all working, therefore, to the same general conditions of sale, which was a, a very... Uh, large uh, piece of legislation and, uh, and requirement but it gives a commonality and it must help the general public because they all know we're all all reputable auctioneers are operating to the same uh, rules and regulations. In an average year there's about 1.1, 1.2 million transactions uh, throughout the UK. This year it's probably expected to be half of that um, yet auction market has only dropped by 20 percent which is really encouraging for auctioneers. People like the certainty of sale by auction.